in this video we will learn how to search information using computer as i have mentioned earlier you can practically find anything you want using your computer sitting in the comfort of your home for example you can read newspaper you can read newspaper you don't have to sub you don't have to ask for so many newspaper but on computer you can read whatever newspaper you want to read you can watch you are missed out missed out tv serial so whatever tv serial you have missed out on your computer you can watch tv serial you can compare prices of the equipment you want to buy compare prices and in fact you can also buy if you want and then somebody will deliver to your home and will charge you or will collect the money only on delivery you can listen to listen to old songs you can listen to old songs now for doing all these things you need a program and because you need to go to the computer of somebody else so you need a program need a program and this program is called browser what is this program this is called browser the name of this program is browser browse browse means as from the english word browse so this is called browser because it can browse all over the world computer all over the world so there are millions and millions of computers today all over the world which is providing information and also selling things etc so you can with this program you can actually go to these computers and get your job done now there are two popular browsers one is from microsoft company which is called ie and second is from the company computer company called google and the name of that browser is chrome and the good news is both these browsers program are free so it means you can choose both are good so you can choose any of the two and then you can start now <coughs> of course you need to have internet connection so you need a program and you must have internet connection internet connection if you do not have internet connection then you cannot go to somebody else computer so you need two things you need number one browser program and number two internet connection once you have on your pc then you are ready to basically look at the information available through or available in the world so what you will do now the first step is start your pc number 1 start pc start your computer i am calling in short pc because pc stands for personal computer because originally the computer you was not personal it used to only belong to companies they used to be very big and that is why this name personal computer or in short pc has come because now these computers are available and you can buy for your own personal use that is why it is called personal computer so the first step is start the computer we have already gone start with the you know switch on the power then switch on the start button of the computer that is like switch of starting switch of the computer and then wait if password is required give the password once the screen activity on the screen stops that means your computer is successfully started after that you check whether internet is connected or not 
चेक इंटरनेट कनेक्टेड सो दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज बिफोर यू स्टार्ट फॉर सर्चिंग इंफॉर्मेशन यू हैव टू इंश्योर दैट द इंटरनेट इज कनेक्टेड एंड हाउ टू चेक द इंटरनेट इज कनेक्टेड और नॉट सो यू हैव दिस स्क्रीन ऑन द कंप्यूटर एंड एज आई मैंशन दैट देर इज ए बार इन द बॉटम एंड दिस बार हैज ऑन द राइट हैंड साइड there will be set some icons like this and one of them is for internet and normally it will have a sign of globe so this has a sign of globe so you familiarize yourself with this particular uh icon here at this place and this indicates if this icon is green and it is blinking if it is green then it means the internet is connected if there is something like a cross which is marked on this sign then it means internet is not connected so once you ensure once you have checked that the internet is connected then you have to start the browser program browser program start the browser program now how to start the browser program again this browser program is either there on the body of the screen as i mentioned there is some icon here so one of them is for browser and sometimes they are also also sitting here on the left hand side of this bar so either here or here and in case of the internet browser it is having a sign e with a disk like a globe disk so this is the type of symbol it will have but anyway i think this is something which you need to familiarize one time that what i what is the icon for the browser program once you have identified the browser program how to start this program you just put your cursor on this program cursor position the cursor here and double click double left click so two steps first step is position cursor position cursor and then after position the cursor cursor and then double left double left click means two times so when you position the cursor 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 means this arrow with the like this arrow so you position the cursor on top of the browser program icon and then double click once that happens the browser program will start once the browser program starts you will see the screen will change so the these icons all will be dis disappearing and now the screen will become like this then this more the this will remain and then there will be a bar at the top where there will be this sign so this will be there there will be this top sign <coughs> and then you will get one more bar and this second bar is very important and then there will be a in this bar there is a very, there is an empty space there is an empty space here empty space and this empty space is where you will have to write the address of the computer you want to connect so that is step number 4 step number 4 is write write means how will you write you will have to key in using the board so so first you have to enter the enter means key using the enter using keyboard enter using the keyboard 
the enter using the keyboard the address address of the computer you want to go or you want to connect suppose you want to look at this video now where will you go so the address of the place where i have i have put the video is called adu adu bay dot co so this is the place where i have put the address adu bay dot co so all you have to do is you have to go and type in the adu bay dot co in this space now once you type in this adu bay dot co then what you have to do is after that either you press the enter key of the keyboard or you can double click so either the two ways it will happen and then you will be able to get to the to this computer which has this information of all the videos and then again as soon as you go to adu bay adu bay dot co and again remember here you can type in small letters big letters does not matter anyway as long as you are typing this correctly you will reach there you have to wait for a while and then you will find something you know after two three screens here this portion below the body now will give the information which adu bay has so this will be as per adu bay design so now the body will be as per adu bay design so once you get this adu bay design you will find that there is a tab or there is an icon which says parents and if you put the cursor on parent you will find there is like basic computer basic computer and you go there you will find all these videos and then you just select whatever video you want to uh, watch and click on that you will be able to watch the video sitting in comfort of your home now the question comes suppose you don't know the address if you don't know the address then what do you do so then you have to follow something else now if you don't know the address then you have to go to something called information directory you have to go to information directory and the information directory is at a website called or a computer called google.com so if you don't know the address then what you should do is you should type this address and this address will take you to the computer of this company google and this company google it has provided free of charge to all of us a information directory and this information directory is where if you don't know the address of the computer you want to go you just go there and then what you will find you will find a again here there on this company's page you will find a blank space like this and whatever question you want to know or whatever information you want to know just type the question for example if you want to know what is the uh, ranking of india in the world then you just put ranking of countries in the world so if you want ranking by gdp just say ranking of countries by gdp if you want to search for songs of lata mangeshkar then you just start typing lata mangeshkar and then suddenly it will start prompting you lot of possible similar names or question which you want to for example if you just type l a t a and then the very second name it will prompt you lata mangeshkar you don't have to even type the complete <coughs> name lata mangeshkar just typing l a t a lata itself 
it will prompt you oh you want lata mangeshkar and then you just put your cursor on lata mangeshkar and click on that and you will get to the computer which has songs of lata mangeshkar so and then when you get the songs of lata mangeshkar the computer will give you number of options it will give you number of computers which has the song for example lata mangeshkar is very popular and therefore lata mangeshkar songs are actually available on uh, computers of many companies so it will give you a list 1 2 3 4 5 and then along with a brief description so it gives you list plus brief description brief description that means which company's computer is this and then depending upon whatever you think is appropriate among the top 3 if you select one i think that will be good enough and how to select you just put your cursor on that particular description and then suddenly the cursor will change into a shape of a hand with a pointing arrow and that means you have now selected it and then again follow the magic instruction of double click double click double click and you will get to the information page of the computer which has songs of lata mangeshkar and you can if you think that you have got the right song then that is fine suppose you haven't got the right song then you can again go back to google directory and then search again or if you want a particular song then you can just put the lyrics of that song or just the title of that song and then search again chances are you will be able to get precisely in one shot to the desired song which you want so let me now summarize this powerful uh, function which is available on computer and this function is free of charge both the programs which are available uh, which are needed for doing this activity are free first the browser is free by uh, using which uh, you uh, can connect to any computer and the second thing is the information directory by google is also free and in fact it also prompts you in fact you don't have to even type the full question even half question it will prompt you so even it will save the effort of typing the full question and normally my experience is that within the top 3 or within the top 5 you get the desired you know uh, address of the computer which will get the uh, answer to the question which you are looking now the basic thing is you need to frame your question in a clever manner i mean progressively once you start using it you will learn how to frame your question in short and sweet manner so that you get very uh, you know quickly to the target which you want to achieve so it's a little bit of learning here that how to frame your question in a in a uh, short and sweet manner i mean you have to and that is called keywords you have to basically uh, focus on keywords rather than all the grammatical words is not that important so you have to focus on keywords nouns and basically verbs these are the keywords uh, from uh, the content point of view or from the point of view of google directory to understand what you want so i think this is something once you start uh, practicing and start using it you will find there is no no uh, this magic box is really like a genie and almost the world is in your home thank you